in our T480 video, we had a question from Austin Obese 9968 He asked, is the T480 good for architectural design? So first we're gonna test AutoCAD, like the sample floor plan here. Didn't take that long to load at all. Running quite smoothly. Let's go to our task manager here. And yeah, got a couple spikes 200. And our GPU is sitting around 50%. But yeah, it's doing pretty good. And by the way, we are plugged into the wall, so that might change something. Let's move on to Inventor. All right, let's create a new project. Standard part. Ooh, that took a little bit. Nice. A little bit of lag on the image generation. So far, pretty good. But let's open up a more complicated model. Not too bad. Some spikes when we open up the project and stuff. But yet again, hanging around 55% usage. So, oh man, we can't enable ray tracing. Oh, yes we can. <laughs> let's make this thing struggle. But honestly, it renders it pretty fast and it looks pretty good. All right, so the T480, well, it does pretty good with architectural design applications. And I gotta say, for AutoCAD, it does it with a breeze. And Inventor, it struggles a little bit more. And Fusion 360, yeah, it's a harder to run program, but it is just fine. So what I recommend the T480 for architectural design apps, and I would say yes, I don't know how it would do with much bigger projects and assemblies, but if you're just going through school and you need it for that or just hobbyist use, this thing is plenty fine. So if you guys have any more questions on the T480, then please leave them down in the comments below because we love answering your questions.